why you should not be using Equid as your online e-commerce partner. So Equid is a shopping cart site which enables you to sell your products online. And Equid might seem like a great option because it's free, but today I'm going to talk about why you shouldn't be using Equid as your online e-commerce partner. But before I get into that, I'm going to tell you guys for who Equid is actually reasonable. So the people that should be using Equid versus the people that shouldn't be using Equid. Equid is basically a free program. There are paid versions, but most people use the free program. And it's only really useful for you if you're just starting out your business. So if you've never sold any of your products online, you have no customers, you're just trying everything out for the first time, then you might want to use Equid. And if you're one of those people, make sure to watch this video till the end because I'm going to show you guys how to create your account on Equid and how you can start selling your merchandise on Equid if you're just a starter. But for now, I'm going to tell you guys on why you shouldn't be using Equid. So if you're someone that already has a business that has customers, that has a clientele, that has a retail, that has a certain number of sales that are made each week or each month, then you're probably well established and you shouldn't be using Equid. Because Equid is quite well known for its site crashes, Equid does not provide a very great customer service, and the app integrations on Equid are very limited. So Equid does not allow for third-party integrations as much as a lot of the other applications available for e-commerce. And I'm gonna be talking about the alternatives to Equid if you're an established business person. So why I don't recommend Equid? You might be wondering, it's free, it's easy, why, sh why don't I recommend it? It's because Equid does not allow you to cross-sell and upsell and coupon efficiently. So if you run a large business, you will want to have a lot of integration so you can easily cross sell, you can detect your analytics, you can easily coupon and have couponing partners, and you will want to have a bunch of integrations, especially with your marketing apps. Equid does not enable that and Equid is not very optimizable and it's not very customizable. So if you're used to selling merchandise online, Equid will seem like very simple and it won't allow you to have your own business identity. So if Equid is something that you should stay away from if you're an established business, what should you go for? So if you're an established business, you should stay away from Equid. But I do recommend some alternatives to Equid. So the alternatives to Equid include Shopify. Shopify is very great because it allows you a bunch of third-party integrations. It allows a lot of customization and it also provides you with analytics. However, Shopify does charge sales and tax fees and all those kinds of small kinds of cuts. But in general, for your user experience, and especially if you have a large clientele, those things are very small and in insignificant compared to the streamlined and efficiency that Shopify will provide you. It will also provide a bunch of cross-selling, upselling, and couponing integrations, which will be very helpful. Next up, we also have Square up.com so square up is very efficient as well it also will take some cut in sales and does take you know uh, transaction charges and all those little cuts but it's also very efficient and provides you with the same kind of integrations that shopify provides you and thirdly another alternative we have weebly weebly will enable you to sell your products online you can even create your own website using weebly and it's also a better alternative to Equid. So coming back to Equid, if you're someone that just started a business, so you have no clue who you're going to sell to, you have no idea how to get started with this, you have no customers yet, you don't know how many sales you're going to make, you should try Equid. In that case, Equid is not a bad option for you because it's free, it's easy to use, and you won't have a lot of things to be confused about. It's going to be pretty simple for you. There are just a set amount of things that you will have to just fill out, and then you can start selling online. And if your orders and the amount of sales you create, if that increases, then you can move on to a different site like Shopify or SquareUp or Weebly. So... To get started on Equid, you're just going to click on get started for free on the top right. And then you're going to register. You're going to put in your details and I'll catch you guys in a minute. 
So once you've added all your details on Equid, you're just gonna have this dashboard and over here we just have these uh, dummy, we just have this sample account to see what kind of products we can add. So this is all you have with Equid. As you can see on the left side, we have these little tabs that we can see. First is our dashboard. This is gonna be like your landing page once your account has been created. Then you have your sales, so your orders, abandoned carts, that means like canceled orders, your customers, people that have ordered from you, and orders that you can edit. So orders that haven't been shipped that can still be edited. Next you have your catalog, so on your catalog you're going to add the items that you're selling. And then you have marketing, after that you have your reports, and over here you just have a general overview. And even on Equid, if you want to sell on Facebook or Instagram or Messenger, you're going to have to end up paying for their premium plan, which is kind of not worth it considering if you're just starting out, you don't have that kind of money to subscribe to their premium plan just yet. Then you can also add your website and add your Facebook page. Secondly, Equid is also available on iOS and Android. So you can use Equid on your phone and manage your sales and that's pretty efficient if you're running a small business and you're just starting out. So you might not have that kind of professional equipment and you know you might just want to start selling pillowcases from home and that's very efficient if you can just use Equid on your phone and start making sales. Then you also have this design element and this is it with it because there aren't a lot of customization options available on Equid. So you can just pick out of the three what kind of image size you want, the ratio, what kind of product card details, layouts you want. And this is it. So you're not able to really change that much. You just have to select within the given options. And there aren't, you know, a lot of design options available on Equid. Then you're also going to set up, you know, payment options. And then you're going to add your shipping and pickup details. So how your items are going to be shipped, how you're going to deliver them. And you also have your general settings. So if you want to add taxes and stuff, and that's around it. This is your profile. And over here, you can see they have a venture program, a business program, and an unlimited program on Equid. But in my opinion, Equid is not worth it. You should definitely go for Shopify, SquareUp, or Weebly if you're looking for an e-commerce partner. So just to sum up, Equid won't provide you with a lot of customer support. Their site does have crashes if you have a large clientele. So if you have a lot of sales, your website might crash. And they also have limited web integrations. You can't really cross-sell, upsell, and have good couponing on Equid because it doesn't have that many integrations available and Equid is not optimizable and customizable so it won't really fit your brand and your brand's aesthetic. So that was it for today and I'll catch you guys in the next